Chinese lab says it made a breakthrough in 6G mobile technology as global standard setting race heats up. Government-backed institute Purple Mountain Laboratory says it has made 6G speed breakthrough. Project's breakthrough was achieved in collaboration with telecoms giant China Mobile and Fudan University. A Chinese lab said it has made a breakthrough in next-generation mobile communications technology as the global power struggle over standards setting in the telecom industry continues to heat up. A government-backed institute called Purple Mountain Laboratory said that a research team led by its chief scientist professor Yu Xiaohu had achieved a sixth-generation level wireless transmission up to a speed of 206.25 gigabits per second for the first time in a lab environment, according to a statement on its website. The project was supported by a special government project on 6G and achieved in collaboration with telecoms giant China Mobile and Fudan University. The speed achieved is a world record for real-time wireless transmission within the terahertz frequency band, which is considered to be the bedrock for future 6G mobile communications, according to the Purple Mountain statement. 6G wireless communication technology will be the successor to current 5G cellular technology, which is still being rolled out across multiple countries. 5G enables data to be transmitted at a speed that is 20 times faster than previous standards. 5G was designed to provide faster data rates, ultra-low latency, energy savings, cost reductions, higher system capacity and massive device connectivity, powering new smart services for consumers and an industrial upgrade. The world has yet to agree on technical standards that would support 6G frequencies, signal modulations and waveforms. 3GPP, a leading global communication standard setting organization, has yet to announce a roadmap for 6G. Chinese telecoms equipment giant Huawei Technologies, which is a leading provider of 5G network equipment, expects 6G tech to enter the market around 2030. Ericsson, also a leading 5G equipment manufacturer, anticipates that early standards for 6G could be released in 2027, according to a report from Light Reading, an industry research group. China had the world's largest number of 5G base stations. As of November last year, China had built and put into operation about 1.4 million base stations around the country. However, the rollout of 5G services has been slow, with the industry still struggling to find a killer application for everyday users due to high development and deployment costs. That's about it. If you like what we talk about on this channel and if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. Thanks for time. Till next time. Bye.